patient. And depending upon how well you can control the patient with your stabilization arm, you will decide to use either this configuration as you ascend the spine or cross the arms. Okay. And, and you know, part of it is depending, it depends on your reach, part of it depends on their gender, their size, um, you know, and your ability to actually master a new task. Some of you will struggle and some of you won't. All right? So that being said, as you ascend past T7, this particular configuration probably doesn't work as well. I mean, you can, I, you can mobilize and make the lumbar, you know, the thoracolumbar region move quite well here, but in order to engage these upper thoracic segments by pulling through the shoulder region, sometimes you can actually get this upper segment, these upper segments to move a little bit better. Um, it's harder to actually induce good flexion. I mean, especially when you do an end feel, if you bend forward, and then I lean on her, I can actually really get the spine to flex open. Coming back into extension, it, I can, if I can really pull her back, I'm okay. But sometimes if you cross your arms in front, cut, cut a little bit tighter, scoop his elbow on top. Drop your head forward, bring your elbows up, bring your elbows up, okay. And then I can really get her in deep extension. Okay, so, you know, you're going to have to decide, based on all the tools you have, what it's going to take to really get that, that area that you're interested in to move and assess it. So real quickly then, drop your arms, just relax, okay. This region, I can drop your head forward, I can flex her, feel the spinuses, I can come on back, extend back, I can extend her, I can hook her shoulder, I can feel rotation, I can lightly flex her, I can mark my spot, right, I can rotate her, I can lightly flex her, it's very quick, right, to be able to work from this position. Um, I can end feel her, I can come back here, drop your head forward, I can lean forward, there's my spring, come on back, there's my spring, there's my spring, there's my spring on her cassettes. There's my spinous, her rotation and lateral flexion. Mark it, come around, spring, spring, to set, spring. All right, so um, thoracic segments done very similar to lumbar spine. All right, um, so let's do this. I'm going to give you a thoracic 